Hello everyone. In this tutorial, we will see how to install WordPress using desktop server. So the first thing you would have to do is go to serverpress.com and download the desktop server installable. So just click on this get started for free. So desktop server comes in two different uh, versions. One is the premium one and one is the limited one. You can see the differences uh, on this page. And then uh, for this tutorial, just download the free version. You can add it to cart, uh, fill in all the information uh, and just check it out. So basically it's a free version. So you will not be charged uh, anything for this one. I have already registered and downloaded the desktop uh, server. Uh, once you download it, you will get a .dmg file. Double click on it to start the installation process. You can double click on it. Let's say continue. Give my uh, machine password. Click OK. Accept. So it's a new desktop server in installation. Next. So I will go ahead and pause this video till the installation process completes. Okay, desktop server is now installed. I will click OK and I will click finish to complete the installation of desktop server. At this point, you can go to your launch pad and start desktop server. I will click open. So now once desktop server is installed, we will go ahead and uh, install WordPress using desktop server. So start desktop with privileges. I'll give my machine password. Get rid of the installer. And let's start the Apache and MySQL services. Alarm. All of them. Click next. And basically, now I want to create a new development website using WordPress. So I'll click next. I'll name this widget.dev. And I'm installing 4.6 uh, one version of WordPress. I will say create. And now desktop server will go ahead and create the entire WordPress installation for us. So you don't have to worry about creating databases or anything uh, like that. So now WordPress is installed. When you click next, you will see the link to install WordPress now. Just click on it. And you will see the WordPress installation process, the famous five minute installation. Select the language in which you want to install WordPress. Click continue. I will give my site a title. Enter a username. I'll keep the password, uh, this password as it is. I'll enter my email and say install WordPress. So it, WordPress is now installed and we can log in. I will enter the username and password now. And I will log in. 
and now you can see we have a working WordPress installation ready for us on our local Mac. So that's about it for this tutorial. Thank you for watching.